Hello everybody, it's Thursday and I'm very excited to see you. So let's get started. All right, so today we're gonna to respond to sounds, music, images, and the written word so that we can get a 70 or above on the review quiz and post on the improv Padlet, identifying five things we might use to build a rocket ship. Our question of the day today is, what character are you playing in Wolf today? Now, today's going to be a little weird in that it is asynchronous, so I really hope you're watching this video because it's not going to be good for you if you're not. So the theater exercise that you're going to do today, and you're going to do it along with me right now in the video, is we're going to buzz our lips. Do it three times for 10 seconds each, so let me show you how to do it. Most people can just blow and their lips will buzz. I cannot, so what I do is I roll my tongue like you would as an R in Spanish, and it will make my lips buzz when my mouth is closed. So I do this, that way my lips buzz. You're gonna do it, like I said, three times, 10 seconds a piece. All right, now, if you did not already create a character, then there is a character sheet available for you, and I'll show you that in a moment. You guys are going to play wolf with characters. Now, how are you going to do that when you're not in class? In a discussion. So what's going to happen is I'm going to open a discussion, and I'm going to call it Town of Salem. And in this town, what you're going to do is you're going to introduce yourself, and your character. And we don't know if you're good or evil, but you're gonna build the town. You're gonna talk about different things. I'm gonna give you some prompts in the discussion part. Some of you are good, some of you are evil, and we don't know who is who. So this is building the atmosphere, building the town. Who are you? What do you do? What kind of things are you into? Who are your friends, family? Do you have a pet? Those kinds of things. Building the atmosphere of the town. Then you're gonna have a town hall meeting about all those pesky murders that have been happening. And you're trying to figure out who did it. Now I'm going to send a private email to everyone who is a wolf. If you are not a wolf, then you will not get an email. So if you didn't get an email, you are town. I have not told you what kind of town you are, like if you're a doctor or you're a vigilante, but you know that you are not a wolf, all right? So I hope you have fun on your discussion for Town of Salem. After you've done your discussion and you've had some fun doing that, what you're going to do next is your theater quiz. So your theater quiz, when you go to assignments and you go to Thursday, you can click here and this will take you to the quiz. This is gonna be a vocabulary quiz over all of the things that we have studied so far. So you can see it's going to ask you about these kinds of vocabulary questions. Identifying the roles, different kinds of stuff like that. You should be very prepared for this. So after you've done your quiz, you're going to go to the Padlet and you're gonna answer the prompt. The prompt will be right here. It is not there now because I don't want you guys to do it early because you'll have a tendency to get on there and try and do it early. Don't want you to do that. And if you need them, the character sheets are in the module. So you can click on this button and it will take you to modules. It will take you to week five. And if you scroll down, you will see the character sheet. So if you click on it, it is right here, and this can help you build your wolf character if you have not already built it. I'm hoping that you built it last Thursday when we built characters. All right, don't forget to be checking your work, your missing work, 
We got to make sure that we're doing that. I hope you have a lot of fun. I hope you can try and figure out who's evil and who's not evil. And here's the thing. It's a discussion. So it's all the glasses. So that's a lot of wolves. <laughs> I hope you have a good time. And I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye.